Hey friends, on today's quick video tutorial, we're gonna be talking about what these rings mean on your iWatch. It's super simple, let's jump into it right now. Okay, so let's go ahead and scroll through the Apple website here. If you wanna to go to apple.com, you can actually find uh, this as well. Uh, basically, the three rings are gonna be your move ring, your exercise ring, and your stand ring. So, and the first one is gonna be our red movement ring. And the good thing about this ring is that it counts everything. As long as you have some sort of active movement, whether that's walking the dog, maybe that's cleaning out the garage or taking your kids for a quick walk, playing with them, that is gonna count as your general movement ring. And again, you can see that it's gonna be moving throughout the day, tracking your general movement. Again, the goal for each of these rings is to close them, meaning that you've gotten your daily movement goals accomplished and are staying relatively healthy. So again, as you can see, there's a few things that you can do to adjust the different calories for your general movement you can have as your default, so the ring closes. And then you can obviously up those each day or maybe each time that you're successful in completing them and you want to increase your daily output. So let's look at the second one. The second one is gonna be your exercise ring. That's the green one. And again, this counts for specific movement that has exercise associated with it. And you obviously need to increase your heart rate when you're doing these activities. And again, you can set a lot of these metrics so that it counts when you're logging exercise. Again, the default is gonna be 30 minutes, but again, you can up that depending on your athletic level. Okay, so let's look at the last ring, and this is gonna be your stand ring. And this just basically helps in really motivating you to get up, especially if you have a desk job, walk around. As you can see, just getting up and walking around is great for blood pressure, lowering that, and also reducing the risk of cardiovascular disease. So basically, again, it just wants you to stand, move around a little bit, get up off of your desk chair. Again, you can get notifications on your watch that will remind you to just get up and move around a little bit if you've been seated, maybe because you're working for too long. So that's it, friends. Those are what the different rings mean. Again, this is your general movement ring. Green is gonna be your exercise. Blue is gonna be stand. I hope that helps. Again, make sure you subscribe to our channel. We are making a bunch more of these iWatch tutorial videos to help you in your Apple journey. And make sure you hit that thumbs up button if this video has helped. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again on the next one.